What happens if a person has an out-of-state driver's license, but they happen to be in Arizona and they get a conviction for something like a DUI or they get a traffic ticket here in Arizona and are held responsible by a court? I'm Kristen Curry. I'm an attorney here in Arizona. I've been practicing criminal defense for 26 years. Part of my practice involves a lot of issues dealing with the Department of Motor Vehicles. When a person is convicted or held responsible for a traffic violation, the court will report it to the Arizona Motor Vehicle Department. Arizona Motor Vehicle Department then takes the responsibility of reporting it to the other state's licensing agency. So, for example, if a person gets convicted of a DUI, it's reported to the Arizona DMV, they're going to take action as if the person has a driver's license here. So maybe they will give a 90-day license suspension or something like that. They can only suspend a person's driving privileges within their own state, within the state of Arizona. But once they report it to another state, such as if the person has a California license, California will take their own action against the person's license based upon what they would typically do in their own state. Now, let's say for the DUI example, a person is uh, the Arizona DMV suspends their driving privilege for 90 days. If that person is finished with the 90 days, they have to actually reinstate their privilege to drive here. Why is that important if they don't live in Arizona? Well, because if they don't do that, that could end up haunting them down the line because eventually gets reported to the other state that they're still suspended here. And then the other state suspends their license saying, you have something in Arizona, you haven't cleared it up. So we're suspending your license until you clear it up. So even if you have an out-of-state license, it's important to take care of everything within the state where it occurred so it doesn't end up affecting your license even further. If you have any questions about what happens in Arizona with any type of offense and what you need to do, please give us a call, send us an email. We'd be happy to talk more.